when you first open up Fizz Artist, you'll notice a four quadrant system. The upper left quadrant is called the database window, and as we click through these different buttons here, you can see how this window changes. So while we're here, I'm just going to drag down an object like that. Now this window in the lower left, it's called the scene tree window, and a tree window because we have these containers here, which will is eventually stack up and build a tree. The upper right window is called the editing window and you can see as I change up here this window also changes to let us edit whatever it is we have as a container. The lower right window is the render window or the preview window and in here we're going to see any real-time changes that we make to our container so if I move my container left to right up and down we can see the change within this window. We can also come within this window and work and drag right in this window as well. Now in the very lower left you're going to notice a save button, a save as button, and a close button. To the right of that is also an undo button and a redo button. Anytime you need to undo an action you can hit that undo button. In the very middle of the screen there is a trash can so we can drag anything that we need to get rid of to this trash can. For instance, if I want to get rid of this circle, I can drag that right to the trash can. Below the trash can, you will notice a couple more buttons. And the main ones for now that we'll focus on are TA and SA, our safe area and title area. We also have a key button here, which shows us our key channel. This BB button stands for bounding box. And as I drag another object down, Again, you can see this BB is on. If I turn that off, it is now not on the object. To the right of the trash can, you'll notice a timeline control. This is where we set our keyframes and play out our animations. In the very upper right, you'll notice an X button. This closes out Viz. The upside down triangle in the middle minimizes it. At any point, if you want to drag a window around or resize it you can drag in the middle here by this little icon and it will resize the render window it is pretty limited as to which windows you can drag around you can drag your columns around over here if you need more space to look at your items within your server 